Hey guys, Frankie, licensed massage therapist with Warwick Chiropractic and Massage here in Lacey, Washington. A question I get asked a lot by clients is, how much of this information do you really need to know? The answer is simple. When you're coming in as a new client or if anything in your health history changes and it's written down on your health intake form or we're asking it for it on that form, that's what we really need to know. Those are the things that can affect how we do our treatment, how we can help you progress through your pain or help bring you that state of relaxation and wellness that you're looking for. For example, your surgical histories. Surgical histories can be anything from I had my tonsils removed when I was 12 to I had hardware installed in my ankle after a motorcycle accident. Those are things that can potentially affect the treatment plan, so we really do need to know that before we go in. We need to know when it was, and we need to know what the outcomes were, and if you have any lasting hardware within your person. Another example is the almost seemingly random health information, things like allergies, respiratory conditions, cardiac conditions, any musculoskeletal. Musculoskeletal is pretty you know, self-explanatory as to why your therapist would need to know that. But we do know, need to know the other things as well because those do affect our treatment plan. If you've got respiratory issues such as asthma, it could mean so much that we change your positioning so it's easier for you to breathe during the session. If you've got allergies, we want to make sure it's not going to be to anything that we might be using in our lotions or our creams or our oils that we're helping to apply to your skin during the massage. One of the very most important things that I get asked about a lot is your medications. Medications can be highly influenced by massage work. We can affect the efficacy, how well it's working for you, how fast it's working in your body. So those are things we really need to know, even if it's just a temporary medication or if it's an over-the-counter pain reliever. What we do as massage therapists can highly impact how that works in your body and whether or not it works like it's supposed to. For example, if you're on antibiotics, that typically means you've got an active infection. And if you have an active infection, we can't treat you at the time. It's not safe for you as a client because the work we do not only influences the medication itself, but also the fact that we can make the infection worse. It could spread the infection throughout your body. And that's something neither of us wants. What we need to know is that you're clearing these medications, that your doctor is okay with you getting this massage, that they've been made aware that you want to have this massage. So if you're at all in, if you're at all confused or if you've got any questions or if you just want a little clarification, talk it through, you can always contact your massage therapist, your physician, or any healthcare professional, preferably the ones who've been prescribing you that medication as they will know why. So if you've got any questions, please feel free. Come in, talk to us. We really want to help you out. We'd love to see you on our tables at Warwick Chiropractic and Massage in Lacey, Washington, and I hope you guys have a great day.